Hey everybody, um, welcome to my channel. My name is Jay, and in today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to make like one of these buttons. They won't work, but like, I can show you how to make one of these actual like buttons. They actually won't work and they won't do anything, but still, they're just gonna be like buttons, just in case. It's gonna be a really quick tutorial because of that. So, the first thing you'll play. Okay, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is. I'll click file and then make a new project. Good work. Now, you're going to want to go to starter GUI, click the plus, and then go and click screen GUI. So, now that you're in screen GUI, there's going to be a new tab up there, up in here called UI, you're going to want to click button if you're going to make a button. Um, I'm just going to make a button. And so now you can customize the button. I'm going to show you how to customize it because you might not know what to do, even though it's kind of obvious. So open properties. Um, and down. I don't like the outline, so I'm just going to do zero for the border. And um, I said zero. Um, then scroll down some more. And then I might want to rename the actual thing, like the actual visual button. Um, so now we're in my favorite part called text. Font face, that means just the font. I want to make it something cool. Like, sure, luckiest guy or Callum. Callum, we'll do Callum. I like it. And then I think I'll just do bold. I want to make it a little bit bigger. And there is something there to make it bigger. The text size is down there. And I would like to change mine to like, um, maybe like a 24, or, or a 30, yes a 30, I like 30, and then, oops, um, oh, 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 okay, but then there's also other things we can do, other than the text, like, background, wait, background. I like to change the color to like one of my favorite colors, like such as blue. I love blue. Perfect. I love that a lot. Add to custom colors. Beautiful. It kind of matches the sky. We can also put it down if we want, but um, I'm not figuring that out yet. So, now you're going to go... Wait. Go back to text button, and then click like wait. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. Um. So there's layout, and there's also model. I like to have a model. Wait. Okay, I want to change the name of it first to. Um, button example. Okay, cool. Oopsies. Um, example. So we're going to go to button example. And then... Oh, it's somewhere. So, there's something. It's somewhere. Um. Sorry, I was just checking something out. Oh, style. It's called style. I love this button. So, you just change the button style. I like to do the round. This is not my favorite. This is one of my favorites. This one 
looks kind of ugly. And I don't like that one at all. This one I hate too. But this is my favorite. Then it has some shading to it, see? Um, and if you can't see that, sorry. Like, okay. So, now, I'm actually going to call it something else, like the actual text, something else. Um, I don't know if I showed you how to do that. So, you go to text. Somewhere here. Text, yes. And then, the, it says text here. Now, we can change the text. Let's see. I'm going to call it. Let's let's think. What should I call it? Um, I'm going to call it. Um, yeah, most of you are making um, buttons for shops, so I'm going to call it shop. So yeah, and then it has like this delightful thing where it goes lighter when you are tapping it. Which is awesome. So now that you've done shop, you can do some other stuff with it. Like I'm not going to go through all and every detail about them, this stuff. But if you guys liked this um thing, then you guys can ask me to make more of these things about the button. So, but let's do some more things. Like dive, dive deeper into this button. I believe if we just click plus to the thingy, we can see some other cool stuff, like frame. This, I believe, wait, so the button example, I think if we like, oh wait, if you guys are like making something where you want to like sell something, like with Robux, I know exactly how you guys can do that. So you might want to publish the game or save it, whatever. Um, like publish it and make it private though. Like publish to Roblox, just click publish to Roblox. Um, I'm just gonna call it test um YouTube. Okay, great. Description. Um, and then create. Loading place, it's loading my place. Now I'm going to quick cancel my stuff. Well, actually. Okay, great. Now we just go to game settings. And then we can go to security. Then you should allow third party sales to make it work. That's what I saw. So, now let's play this and see what this thing does. Well, like, if it works when we're in game. Let us check. Okay, I tapped shop. Looks nice. So, we're going to dive deeper on these Roblox scripting thingy lessons, Roblox lessons, soon. I promise I'll make more. Okay, um, um, see you guys later for this one. Adios. Make sure to subscribe too. Yeah.